guys, it's Mason from Digital Musketeers, and today we're going to learn how to make this tile screen. First thing you want to do is open up After Effects and then start a new project. After you got the new project open, then you want to import the video file that you want to apply this to. After you get your video file set up, you need to duplicate that layer. And then go to the top video layer and scrub through until you find a frame that you like. After you find a frame that you like, you need to right click on the video and go under time and click freeze frame. After you hit freeze frame, then you're going to go under layer and then go to pre-comp. Once in the pre-comp, you want to want to mask out your subject and then go into the effects panel and grab curves and threshold. He's going to pull out the stylized detail that you want. The next effects I'm going to get is Stroke and Drop Shadow. It's going to give it that more stylized, pop off the page look. It might be kind of hard to see the white on that transparent layer, so I'm going to turn the transparency off. After I finished with the drop shadow and the stroke, I decided that I wanted to get the background more of a distressed look to make the image pop off the page. Then I decided that I was going to add a title for fun. After I finished with all the stylizing, it's time to animate it. First thing you want to do is hit the stop clock on the first frame. 
It'll help you set up your keyframes. Then you scrub to where you want your last animation frame to be and hit the diamond to indicate that's your last keyframe. After making that last keyframe, what you want to do is go into transform and move your object. I like to mess with the scale and the rotation. You can do whatever you want though. And there it is, our stylized title page. If you like this video and you want to see more of our content, don't forget to subscribe. If you didn't like this video, give it a thumbs down. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If your feelings are a little bit more complicated than that, leave a comment. And you can always comment for suggestions for future videos. I'm Mason from Digital Musketeers and we'll see you again next week.